I wrote Living in the Future for a main reason, to try to put some structure on the things I write. I write on a daily basis, uh, day by day, trying to analyze uh, technology, innovation, acquisitions, etc. And when you do so, when you write on a daily basis, it looks like everything that is moving amazingly fast, uh, blazingly fast uh, all the time, but you don't have to the, the, the time to stop a little and say, okay, what's going on? What's really going on? So what I try to do in the, in the book is to structure a little bit and say, okay, where are we? We are in the middle of a, probably the biggest challenge that we have faced in the, in the, in the history of mankind, the most existential challenge, is whether the, the, the human civilization is going to be viable in, in a few decades or not, or, or if we will be trying to survive in, a, in, our own, in an overheated planet. The, 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 the type of situations we are seeing in Australia right now, for instance, people uh, not being able to get any water or uh, you know, fires, wildfires all over the place. So uh, despite that, I mean, the, the, this is mainly a technological problem. This is a technological problem that comes for the, because of the use of mainly two technologies, uh, fossil fuels on the, on the one hand and the, the internal combustion engine. So um, these two technologies on the other hand have been fantastic. They've been able to give us this uh, moment of a civilization with, where we enjoy more wealth, probably unequally distributed, but we are wealthier, we, are, um, we live longer, we are in a very nice situation but unfortunately it's unsustainable. So the idea of the book, the point of the book is to point, is to point out that technology is good and technology could put together a very nice scenario where it would be fantastic to, to, and very highly desirable to live in that scenario. The way we will live, the way we will enjoy the cities, our homes, etc., the way uh, we will take care of ourselves, but we need to introduce some changes. And, first, and, and most of all, we need to face that challenge, the, the environmental challenge, the, the, the problem of uh, sustainability. And that's the main rationale for writing a book like this, like living in the future.